Hello friends, this is Jim O'Rear. Welcome back to Jim O'Rear's Wacky World. We are once again at Universal Studios Orlando Halloween Horror Nights. And we are going to go into the Tribute Store. If you don't know about the Tribute Store, every year they set up a highly themed store where they sell merchandise for the event. And this year it's kind of a, I don't know, a rundown New York subway kind of theme. Uh, lots of neon, lots of spray paint and stuff like that. So come take a look at the 2024 Tribute Store. The Tribute Store this year is uh, right there. You enter through that uh, shipping crate. <laughs> and when you go in there, it, uh, it it's like a, a, gosh, I don't know, like New York and broken down subways and underground tunnels in, in New York and subway tunnels where people are hiding and living in the subways and mixed in with all that cool decor is lots of merchandise for Halloween Horror Nights this year. And um, it's, uh, the theme this year is, you know, it's, it's very well decorated. I just am not a huge fan of the theme this year. Um, they usually have a lot, I don't know, a lot, a lot more to it, I guess you could say. Um, they do have these little bats all around. You can see a bat target there that I just passed by. Um, that's a theme that's running all the way through every room. Um, but here's some Ghostbuster stuff since they're doing a Ghostbusters haunted house this year, as well as, uh, some Mel's die-in and Major Sweets. Um, lots of things from their show this year. I love that Major Sweets shirt right there um there, there's that bat again bat target on the wall um there's little boo and shopping carts and then you move on over here into this other room and they've got a cool little rain effect right here with the high voltage um and uh more little boos uh when we look right over here see like i said it's, it's very good the decor is very cool uh when we go in here lots of neon in this room uh, sort of a, I don't know, a storage area maybe of, of where they have hidden their their light up signs and road signs and stuff like that in the subway or underground tunnels. And uh, some very bright merchandise for Halloween Horror Nights right there. Uh, more little booze and uh, tribute store sign that's lit up like Fosse, Fosse, Fosse. Uh, right over here, they've got, they, I guess this is sort of like a homeless tent. It was somebody that's living in that uh, that subway or that tunnel, and they've got their, their little home set up there. And looking around here more, there's, uh, you know, more very cool decor with various show items mixed in there. And I like that skeleton right there. That's very cool. Skeleton mouth with lightning eyes. Uh, let's take a look right over here. Here's some Insidious stuff, some Bloomhouse stuff um, for those haunted houses. And then if you go out this hallway and uh, travel down this way, you've got a lot of graffiti-lined hallways. It takes you to the next room of the store. And this room is uh, more decor. This is kind of a, I don't know, looks like a, maybe a, the power plant or the, the power system for the subway and the subway uh, cars. Uh, there's that bat painted on the wall over there. Like I said, you see this bat everywhere. Uh, some more cool merchandise. There's even the bat t-shirt. Some of the original characters on that shirt right there. There's... Uh, there you can see food right over there. I'll show you that in a second. They've got a little snack area there with uh, with themed food. And there's a better look at the bat painting. All right, themed food. Uh, they've got like little Boo cookies and Batilda cookies and Major Sweets. And I love this right here. These little Ghostbuster ghost traps that are, are little cakes and uh, marshmallow men. Love that. Uh, here is a subway car that's sitting down there in the subway, as well as uh, looks like a, maybe a subway ticket booth and cashier, and uh, and the newsstand that was there at the subway. And closing it off, looking over everything, is the bat right there. Evil looking bat. Uh, and then you take your way, uh, your exit out of, of the store. So there you go. That's a look at this year's tribute store. There you go, that's a look inside the 2024 Universal Studios Halloween Horror Nights Tribute Store at Universal Orlando, Florida. 
pretty cool theme, lots of interesting details. Check it out if you have a chance. So I hope you've enjoyed watching this video. If you have, click that like button to let the powers of being know that you like the video. And while you're at it, click on follow or subscribe and you'll be notified when I upload new videos. So thanks again for watching. We'll see you next time.